Coco! <laughs> Coco! Oh god. <laughs> I'll be waiting for you. I have dress. a knife! <laughs> Hello. Don't fuck with me! Hi guys. I'll fucking kill you! No he won't. Your head looks like an onion! <laughs> she has a very oddly shaped head. Yeah, she, like, it's very wide and uh, tall at the top. She looks like an alien from Star Trek. It looks like her, her hair is a helmet. Hmm. Hello! Yet again, my friends, and welcome to an exciting episode, I can't guarantee that actually, of Dangan Rumpa! Of course you can, it's gonna be thrilling. Nigger Slappy Havoc! <laughs> well, Kyoko's gonna be waiting for us in the dressing room, that's pretty exciting. Ooh, I'm excited. See, see you there. Oh. Hey, wait, Kyoko, let's just fuck here! <sighs> I got a bed! Without Senpai acknowledging me, Kyoko disappeared into the depths of the darkened hallway. <laughs> All right, Makoto. I know we're not supposed to go out during night time, but... Sorry, Nichtim. I can't just not go. He said to an empty hallway. Yes, you can. Those are some big hinges on that door. I don't know if you realised. Oh, love, you got some big hinges. Sure, you mean... <laughs> oh, see ya. Hey. Sorry for asking you to meet me here with me so late. It's okay, I'm used to it. <laughs> that was very passive-aggressive. <laughs> no, it wasn't. Oh. No, imagine- yeah, I just imagined him saying that like an actual fact. I'm used to it. Correct. Indeed. Oops. <laughs> yeah, whatever. So then. Well then, let me get straight to the point. It's something you can't talk about in front of the surveillance camera, right? So does that mean- Does this have something to do with whatever you stole from Monokuma? You fucking what? Monokuma told us earlier that someone had stolen something from him. Was it you? <laughs> Fucking face. That's right. So I was right. Yeah, I'm ah, so clever. I'm a detective. But what did you steal? His so... virginity. I stole this. A key? <clears throat> but looking at it, I could tell that it wasn't just any key. It was the Keyblade. Dude, if that were a Keyblade in Kingdom Hearts 3, <laughs> I'd buy the game just for that. It was shaped like Monokuma, and it was probably the only key of its kind on Earth. I have a spare! <laughs> so where did you get this? So... From the Headmaster's room. Uh, what?! <laughs> you snuck into the Headmaster's room?! But wasn't it locked? However... The lock was broken. What?! It was Sakura. She did it for us. She did? Indeed. Remember what she said in her note? I'm going to- I'm not going, just going to lay down and <laughs> I'm die. I'm going to lay down and die. I will fight I you. I will sit down and die. <laughs> so Sakura broke into the Headmaster's room for us? That's right. That's right. So that we could uncover whatever secrets might lay hidden within. She did that for us. She violated the school ri Well, I mean, she was gonna die anyway. Yeah. She knew that, that's why she killed herself, probably. Part of the reason. She'd already decided to die, so her last act was to defy the rules of this place. Indeed. I noticed the room was open after the class trial was, uh, was over yesterday. But if I just strolled into the room, Monokuma would have noticed right away, which is why I used you as a decoy. So you asked me to meet you at the data center in order to... Correct. Correct. I wanted you to draw Monokuma's yeah, attention. Yeah, that, that. That's what I was going to say. <laughs> I took that opportunity to sneak into the headmaster's room, and as a result, I found this key. Whoa. This is cool. Can oh, I fuck you? Please let me touch your leg. No. <laughs> then, what you told me about yesterday, did that come from the headmaster's room too? <clears throat> Nukuro Ikusaba. <laughs> Did you find out about this Mukuro Ikusaba while you were in there? <laughs> Indeed. I did a f I did a file in the I did find a file in the headmaster's room that talked about her. Yes. I don't know all the details yet, but one thing I do know is that Mukuro Ikusaba is dangerous. Dangerous. In other words. Dangerous. <laughs> dangerous. She may very well be the mastermind. Mastermind? Come on, dude. But didn't Alter Ego say that the headmaster was probably the mastermind? Wrong. 
No, the headmaster isn't the mastermind. I'm sure of that. He's the headmastermind. <laughs> it's the man behind Master him. Headmind. He's the, <laughs> the man greatest supervillain of all kind. <laughs> uh, of all mankind, I mean. Headkind. What? I don't have any proof yet, but I have no doubt I'm right. To make such a strong statement without proof, that's not like Kyoko at all. I really admire her! Oh! <laughs> but if it isn't the, the headmaster, does that mean Mukuro could for fuck's sake? Anyway... Anyway, this key is the one big opportunity we've been waiting for, uh, to get our hands on. Now that we've grasped it, we can't let it go, can we? We could, but I mean... We drop it. What's this key even unlock? So... I don't know yet, which is why I need you to draw Monokuma's attention again while I go and find out. Wait, so you're planning on sneaking back in? A sword base sneak attack! <laughs> you can't! That's way too dangerous! And you want me to draw his attention? I'll do it for a Scooby snack. But we don't actually know there's just one mastermind, right? If there's more than one person watching us... Is that right? But they didn't catch on last night, right? Maybe we just got lucky. Hey. Or maybe the mastermind can't monitor us and control Monokuma at the same time. Huh? Like I said, we didn't get caught last night. But as you said, maybe it was pure luck. This is nice music. Which is why we're going to run the experiment one more time. And if we're successful again... Hmm then what may have just been a lucky guess will be proven true. We could get lucky twice. And I mean, if they die, what they got to lose, you know? They're stuck here anyway. As Kyoko told you, blah, 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 I admire her, I want to fuck her pussy. Hey. If it's true that the Mastermind can't watch us and control Monokuma at the same time, then there would, uh, then there would have been... There would have to be a period of time where the Mastermind is vulnerable. What we need to do is find out for sure if that's actually true and if we can exploit it. Maybe, but no matter what the reward, the risk is just too high. When I think that what might have happened if we fail... Why is that? I don't think you need to worry all that much, after all. Hmm. No restrictions have been placed on our efforts to solve the mystery, am I wrong? Even when I took the key, I didn't break any rules, as far as I can tell. What's that noise? It sounds like a bird on the, on the window. That ah, could well be. But if the Mastermind decides to do something, all the rules in the world will matter. He could just kill us all without a second thought! I see. I see. In that case, even if the plan fails, we'll still be able to prove or disprove the hypotheses. Good point! Correct. In a moment of crisis, will the Mastermind break their own rules or adhere to them no matter what? In other words... In other words, we need to gain... We gain something whether we succeed or not. Now, there's no reason not to do it, right? Well, we'll die, so what good if will that be? spend all your time trying to avoid danger, you'll never move forward. We know the danger, but if that risk means solving the mystery, we have no choice. Hey. Am I wrong? That's a fav that's a catchphrase. Yes. <coughs> and at that moment, what? 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 You just looked at me. Don't oh. fucking do that. <laughs> Your eyes are unworthy. And then sort of the fear, despair, mystery, enemy, view, smile. <laughs> I can't change how I feel, and wouldn't if I could. Because I don't feel that I would. Did, did you hear that little laugh that she did? That she did. <laughs> <laughs> you look like Filthy Frank when you do that. <laughs> it... Abel. What did she give us? What's this? It's a true. letter of consent? Consider it a symbol of my determination. Don't don't open it. Only open it. If she dies. If something ever happens to me. Die, 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 die. However. I'm not planning on dying, but there's always a chance of it, and a death without meaning is unappealing. Hey. Please, I want you to hold on to it for me. 
Fine, I'll hold on to it. Just because you asked me to. Not because I'd like you or anything. But I'm gonna give it back at some point, you can be sure of that. Indeed. Yes, of course. Wow, yeah. disrespectful. Oh, and one more thing. You can't tell anyone about what I've discovered. Sure, because then there's a chance the Mastermind might find out, right? Indeed. Well, there's that too. Huh? You mean there's something- Oh, naive Magozo. Yeah, they don't fucking trust her! Wow. Oh, be a Kuya. Yeah, we'll tell him. He'll be cool about yeah, it. Yeah, we'll tell- we'll tell him that she's got a, a magic key. It's nothing. Forget I said anything. I can't just forget that easily. So then. Who am I again? <laughs> okay then, shall we begin? Makoto. I'm counting on you, Makoto. Let's begin! Yes, it's really me, Makoto. Reel it in. I just have to get Manakuma's attention, right? Well, I'll give it my best shot. Goodbye. I'm going on ahead. The rest is up to you. Him and Aoi should stage a rape. Her cunt goodbye was no different from any other time. <laughs> Unlike every other time, she moved at a brisk pace as she left. Hey, Aoi, can I pretend to rape you? I feel like that we could get the same results with better methods, Makoto. What about actually raping her? <laughs> By force. I'm gonna watch! <laughs> I'll keep him occupied for like... Monokuma would really enjoy that actually because of the despair that was on Aoi's face. The despair of being raped. What about be... the hope in our penis? <laughs> <laughs> he might be of two minds of it. <laughs> what what wasn't? wasn't like every other time was the sudden knot I felt in my penis. <laughs> Wait, no, no. <laughs> No, everything's gonna be fine, I know it! Because it's Kyoko! He likes, uh... Talking to myself helped shake off my anxiety and my depression. And my then I got to work. My despair. Oh wow, look at all this despair around here! Sure would suck if someone missed it! Oh. Oh. Well, I've got a bone to pick with you. Here he is. Well, well! This is a surprise! You being the one to call me out! Hey! Hey! Hey, by the way! Huh? Most suspicious. What were you and Kyoko up to? Going to the bathhouse? Just the two of you? In the middle of the night? Definitely a hot and steamy moment, wouldn't you say? So warm and wet. So wet and warm! I bet you guys! Removed to conform with local and international censorship laws. All over her, didn't you? <laughs> Not gonna talk, huh? Sure, I get it. Well, whatever. Unlike you, I have absolutely no interest in late night bath scenes. <laughs> because I like to maintain a healthy life of observation far away from X rated exploits. Oh, so is that why there are n there's no cam no surveillance cameras in the bathhouse? Bullseye! Or is it maybe because the lens got all fogged up and you can't see anything anyway? Sounds like that's the bullseye to me. You need something? Anyway, you went to all that trouble to get me out here. Now what do you want? Oh well, um. Shit, I didn't think this far. <laughs> there's just something I wanted to confirm with you. What? Whether I'm a mademoiselle or a duda fella? Actually. But in the Bear Kingdom, there is no male or female. That's bullshit. That's bullshit. That's bullshit. Um, actually, there is. <laughs> Seriously? My entire <laughs> then, what am I? My entire existence! I think you've read that out. Who okay. cares? That's enough! I'll get stuck if I think about it too much! So what did you really want to ask me? Oh, well, you told us earlier that your precious had been stolen. What is this precious of yours? What are you thinking? Listen, I'm sure this is a silly question. No way it's possible and all, but... Is that seriously what you dragged me out here to ask me? It's the middle of the night! Unbelievable. You gotta be kidding! You gotta be a hundred megaton fucking kidding me! You're not gonna ask something useful like how to get the best honey or your sign breeding tips. This is just crazy. Are all pupri pu bleh, 
prepubescent teen boys as nutty as you? What the heck? God, you're so annoying! Fine, I'll tell you, it was a key and... Fuck! That's it! What was that second thing? It's a blank, stupid! A secret! Fill it in yourself! <laughs> Fucking... Make me trudge away out of that. I'd like to see what's going on in that brain of yours. And the next time you summon me for something so stupid, I'll open your skull and find out! Dropping more than a few swear words, Monokuma stormed off. It was a bit vulgar. Ooh. I hope I kept him distracted long enough. Now all I can do is wait and hope Kyoko makes it out okay. <laughs> no, she'll be fine. It's Kyoko after all. This is not looking good. <laughs> it isn't, is it? He just went back to bed! He just went back to fucking bed! <laughs> well, I'm probably fine, I'm going to sleep. But he doesn't know where she's gone. Oh my god, there's so much crap. You know what there is? Hmm? The B button. Is that it? That was it. Oh, this... I forgot this. I'm gonna watch your face. <laughs> okay. Okay. Is this the Monokuma Theater? I suppose it is. <laughs> Seems legit. Get jiggy with me! <laughs> <laughs> okay. That was a thing. Super stylish, super fashionable game was cancelled during development, but it'll start <laughs> back up again if Dangan Rampa sells well. Then you guys have to recommend it to your friends too. Is that Ultra Despair Girls? <laughs> that was no, because that was Sakura's Revenge. Doesn't matter. I mean, was it like? It was kind of. It was 3D and it had a Monokuma 3D model in it, so I guess I guess it was similar. Because, I mean, Danganronpa, I think, has sold pretty well. Yeah. What with having an anime. And Good. one of the... Several animes. And being one of the highest rated games on Steam. Three games, so four games so far. Four games so far, a light, yeah. A light novel. Uh, two light novels. Two light novels. Um, Merchandise. No, many... No, more light novels than that. There's... I don't care. It's like three <laughs> light... One of, one of those light novels had two volumes. <sighs> Kill Bill was good. Yet yeah, he feels things. <laughs> must be care must be because I woke up so late. I wonder week. if Kyoko's alive. Oh well, back to breakfast. <laughs> I'm feel I'm feeling a bit sleepy, aren't you? Yeah, I used to have three. Yeah, I do. Oh, What's waiting for us here? Not Kyoko. Not Kyoko. Yeah. <clears throat> You're one minute late, Makoto. How do you explain this? Sorry, I'm not feeling so great today. What's your you know when I do uh, Makoto's voice, I'm doing an impression of my friend Nick. No, oh, yeah. he speaks just like that. Yeah. We did Danganronpa abridged. I want him to voice Makoto. <laughs> okay. Unless I do it. Do you really think a tired excuse like that is gonna work? I don't know if you'll be voicing her. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> huh? uh, you allowed to talk again? That's a shame. Hmm. I don't recall giving you permission. Uh, I just thought just a, a, a day had, had passed. It, it made me rest. Reset. <laughs> Sorry, please don't hate me. Whatever my my punishment, I'll accept it. I'll hang a sign from my neck that says, Bad girl. I'll clean your bathroom with my toothbrush and then use it. 
If you stop making disgusting comments like that, maybe I can forgive you. <laughs> Thank you. I won't make any more disgusting comments, I promise. If I do, you can stuff my mouth full of trash. Oh. As long as it's you and no one else, I don't mind. It's no, it's no use. She's disgusting to the bone. It's no use. <laughs> Take this. <laughs> anyway, where's Ki Oh shit. Anyway, where, after that, <laughs> where's Kyoko? I haven't seen her this morning. Could it be? Not cool. This is worse than being late for lunch, for a date, for your wedding, for anything. Um. Maybe she's mad about what happened yesterday, and she's not going to show up anymore. Maybe she's dead. Maybe she collapsed, and because uh, from tiredness. No. <laughs> I can't tell the others why Kyoko might not be here. The best thing to do right now is just keep quiet. Very strange. Whatever her reason, I'm curious to know what she is doing. I know she's not in our room, so... You know? Oh yeah, you still have her key, right? Well, she oh, has yeah, Monokuma's key. <laughs> ah, are you looking for Miss Carrie Gary? What, what do you want now? Hey, hey! I'm right, right? You're wondering where Miss Kiri Kiri is, right? Do you know where she is? Hmm, well, it's hard to say. Huh? You don't know either. What? It's because he doesn't know. That's why he's here, to try and prod us for information. Uh -huh. Hey, don't you hate it when you ask someone what their favorite movie is and they name some indie bullcrap? I feel like I'm getting whiplash the way he changes subjects like that. Thank goodness, it looks like Monokuma really didn't notice. Here's her head! <laughs> ah! <laughs> so I guess our plan went off just fine last night. <laughs> oh, hey, Makoto, about that plan last night. Yeah, about the one where we break into your office. Oh! <laughs> Which could mean. Hey. Maybe the mastermind can't monitor and control Monokuma at the same time. She been right about that? Hey! Hey! So, was I right? You're looking for Miss Kirigiri! Any idea where she might have gone? Hmm. We have no idea. What the heck? And even if we did know, we wouldn't tell you. Oh, don't be like what that. We're serious. You too? Oh, they all turn on you. You stick them in a school to kill each other, and then they you all put them in a fun little death game, and you make them murder each other. You reveal their secrets, and they don't appreciate you for it. What fucking assholes! And they think I'm the bad guy. <laughs> well, fine, whatever. I don't even care anymore. Sayonara, suckers! As soon as he was gone, our eyes pointed at each other's eyes. Mm. So. What was that just now? Does that mean Monokuma doesn't know where she is either? Hmm. It would seem that way. You know? Where the heck could she have gone? Um... Don't you think we should all go looking for her? Hmm. And how would you suggest we approach that task? Even Monokuma can't seem to locate her. Very suspicious. Yeah, how can, how can he not know where she is? He's become very yeah, defeatist totally. since becoming a team player, hasn't he? Hmm. So strange. Kyoko must have used that key to sneak into some unknown part of the school. But somewhere even Monokuma wouldn't notice? Where could that be? It's Monokuma's key. You'd think he'd, he'd check whatever it opens. Blah, blah, blah. Blah. Do Going get... and looking for her would be more dangerous, though. Do we get daily life in this <coughs> chapter? Phew. Do I get a life? Blah blah. Well, we get, we, we get free time. Owie? Owie. Uh. Her and uh, Yashihiro are the only ones left other than Biakuya that I like. I mean, like, Owie's okay, I suppose. Oh shit, I don't have a present guy. I don't know what to give her. Can you take the wheel for a bit while I look it up? I will take the wheel. Where is she? Okay. Even if it's hard, you have to endure. Endure, endure. <laughs> you can say that again. Well. 
That's a quote from the famous marathon runner Samuel Wanjiro. I'm starting to sound like Makoto. Did he try anal? <coughs> what? Oh, I get it. Endure, endure, endure. Uh, but every person's endurance has a endurance has a limit. Seven inches. Yeah. I think we need a change of pace. Do you want me to read these? Uh, no, I'm fine. And when I think of change of pace, yeah, you're fine. <laughs> yeah. You got it. I can only think fifty laps in the pool. I changed my pace with Hina in the pool today. <laughs> Hina and I grew. Uh, yes, let's give her a present. I'm sure she wants a gun. Right, uh, right. Go down to donuts because I'm trying to orientate it. And do okay, donuts, and then go down by one, two, three, four presents. We don't have any of those. Shit. Then go down by one, two, three, four more to the ring. Uh, no, we did that. That ring didn't do it. Do, didn't do us any good, did it? Oh, do we have the God of War? God of War charm. There you go. This is Sakura's favorite. Yep, it was one of her best. Whoa! What is this? It's super cute. <laughs> For real? You're sure I can have this? Yeah, well, she liked it. Someone's at the door. Someone is at the door. While we're recording. Great timing. <laughs> it's the janitor. He's got he's got a gun! I, ah! I was drinking that! <laughs> you son of a bitch, Janitor! Oh god! Oh! He's attacking us! <laughs> With his beard! And his woman's mind. voice! <laughs> you have to keep the door shut. You have to keep your mouth shut, evil janitor man! Thank you very much. Oh, Thank you. Lovely. It's nice to see you again. Yes, I'm going to McDonald's and then I'm going home. Okay. I'm feeding the dogs. I'm great. <laughs> So yeah, that's our that, that's our uh, that's Janitor. our day plan. That's, that's Dave. <laughs> Janitor's day plan. Janitor's day plan. <laughs> he keeps getting that blanket stuck in the door. <laughs> <laughs> Do you need some help? Five times. That blanket got stuck in the door on his way out. <laughs> we should have had face cam. <laughs> I'm so tired. <laughs> yeah, you look pretty tired. What happened? No. Your face fall in the ugly tree. I woke up earlier than normal this morning, so I decided to do a push-up, sit-up, squat set. Oh. I ended up doing a thousand of each. Oh. Well, that would explain it. Oh. Tired, so tired. I want something sweet. My penis. <laughs> I want those things you get when you mix flour, sugar, uh. butter, and eggs, then deep fry them. Churros? A heart attack? <laughs> Cookies? Churros, holy shit, yeah, churros. You talking about churros? <laughs> oh man, churros are good too. Crunchy on the outside, chewy on the inside, it's, also, it's almost the same as what I'm craving. Cookies. Yeah. I guess you could probably put them in the same category, huh? I mean, still a little... I'm surprised anyone from Japan would know what churros are. Unless they're... Donuts? No, no, no. Not donuts, no. That's not... You deep fry donuts. No, you don't. Yeah, you do. It's donuts, okay. Um... You deep fry them. Okay. Don't tell anyone, but there's actually a bunch of frozen donuts in the warehouse. Okay. Throw those in the microwave for a few seconds and just imagine. Imagine the warm chewiness of that donut. I want to eat your donut. Donuts aren't crunchy on the outside. They can be. You know what Depends I'm saying? Depends on how much sugar you put on them. You know what I'm saying, right? You eat the crap out of that, right? Ugh. I'd eat the crap out of you. <laughs> Not literally. <laughs> no. Good. Just a second. Is there anyone who doesn't? Who on earth? No, who in the whole universe can't say they hate donuts? Uh, someone with diabetes. <laughs> Which I'm surprised you don't. Which I'm surprised you don't have. <laughs> think about the sensation of biting into a donut. I'm just think about the sensation of biting into your ass. Not literally. Not literally. <laughs> I don't know. Like I like donuts, but like when Not you bite into them, the sugar gets on the corners it, of your it mouth. Does, and it, it bothers does. me. It bothers me too. First, the sweetness floods your mouth, then the soft dough cushions oh, you. Oh, 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 Next, you get it, that hint oh, of egg and butter, right? Oh, oh. Those donuts are undercooked. 
Your whole body starts to melt. Oh, back to this again. That's the good stuff. You feel like you're falling into the center of the donut itself. Uh. <laughs> when people talk about the donut effect, that's what they're talking about. Effective. Effective. That's absolutely not true. I, I can't take it anymore. I'm drooling like Niagara, Niagara oh. Falls. Oh. Get out of my way, Makoto. I'm going to uppercut you. I've got an uppercut with your name on it. Oh. I'm not in the way. <laughs> Wait for me, God of Donuts. Fuck. I feel like I'm soaking in the essence of human vitality. What gives you this impression? Uh, Hina again, then. Hina, Hina, wish I'd seen press, her. Press X here. You can do it. You can do it. Oh, hello. Oh. Oh! Oh, it's this bit! He's getting sick. Oh, no, it's not this bit yet. He's getting what? sick. But he's getting it. He's getting He's getting a fever. Yeah. Is he in the laundry room? Come here. There, there we go. go. Can't teleport, though. Uh, that one, yeah. Uh, <laughs> Gear of the God of War charm again. He's so fast. Hmm. Washing machines. Washing growing machines. Up, growing live up longer with Cal gone. <laughs> 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 I think you remember that as well, then. Yeah, I do. A person's ability is measured by the power they display at the point where pressure is applied. Ow! <laughs> <laughs> you got shit abilities. Like, I put pressure on your arm and it hurt you. Yeah. <laughs> That's a quote from the famous baseball player Kenji Jojima. Did anyone ever poke his arm? Yeah, totally. I think. <laughs> Did you hear what she said? She said, yeah, totally. <laughs> I think what he means is that you um, you only really see how strong a person is when they're under pressure. Huh? Just push down on his head there. Uh, oh uh, no, he's sinking. Uh, he's not strong. I wonder how strong I can really Try be. Try on me. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> how about I put a lot of... Sorry, I forgot I'm a dickhead. <laughs> how about... <laughs> Bad, yeah. <laughs> How about I put all the pressure of my body on top of yours and then we'll find out. What if I put pressure on your anus with my dick? You got it. Okay, let's go to the pool. Swim time. Oh, but don't stare, okay? I don't actually have a swimsuit, just a shirt. And when it gets wet, it's kind of embarrassing. Oh. Huh? Although I wasn't embarrassed before, but now I kind of am. I wonder how come. Don't worry about it. Just go. Come on, please give me something. Oh! Cock tease game. I mean, it's not gonna give you. It's gonna give you. You've gotta. You gotta look up that shit from fans. But it's never. It's never the same, you know. It's not quite the same. No. There is nothing like official artwork. Hina and I grew as people today. Who the fuck is even? Who, who's whose shirt is that? Whose dress is? Who wears dresses here? Celeste used to. See not that color. See those short shorts. Those are probably Hina's. I, actually, she hangs up. She she hangs up her clothes in her own room. Oh, and then they're not hers. They're probably Makoto's. <laughs> that he stole. Let's give her a present. No, what are you doing? Why are you starting from the bottom? Okay. Before we'll be closer. No, it's not. No, we're near. <laughs> what was she kidding about? I don't know. Thanks, Picardo. I'm so hungry. Motherfucker! Makaro, help me, I'm hungry! What am I supposed to do? Feed you my penis? Uh, I need food. I need food. I need food. Anything, I don't care. If it's a stack of paper, I need I food. I need food. Why don't you just eat some more donuts, you fat cunt? Just a second. I can't, that's my secret weapon for emergencies only. Yesterday wasn't an emergency well, earlier. I, if I kept gorging on something with that many calories, I get fat in no time. Not the 3,000 fucking press-ups you do. But... 
<sighs> Besides, I don't want anything sugary. Right now, I want a salty snack. Oh. Oh. Like potato chips? <laughs> like ramen. Ramen. Yeah. Ramen my cock in my mouth! <laughs> <laughs> how is that a snack? You got it all wrong. How, how is it not? Speaking of which, what's your favorite kind of ramen? Beef. Show you, without a doubt. I've done all you that, I'm fucking weirdo. Ah, good choice. Definitely the most refreshing option. Pork belly. It's mine. Nice, nice. What about you, Hina? You're worried about calories and also okay. Vegetable ramen. I'm a pork-tested tonkatsu, tonkatsu uh, girl through and through. Or you don't care about calories at all. <laughs> oh, nice. Key element of any tonkatsu ramen is the butter and the extra fat. She confuses me. So you're okay with all that oil? <sighs> ah, talking about it just makes me even hungrier. Maybe it's time. Maybe I can make it to the dining hall. Who says stuff like that? Are you a real man or aren't you? What are you afraid? Afraid of ramen? You're pathetic, Makoto. I'm ashamed to know you. Fuck you. Shut up. Get out of my way. I'm going to show you what a real man looks like. Why you take your clothes off and show me what a real man looks like? Or are you going to stand in my way and suffer the fist based consequences? Motherfucker! Okay. Then don't! If I don't do this now, then w when I am I ever gonna get another chance? Five minutes from now? Yeah. yeah. Ten minutes after? Crying out like a starving raven. <laughs> <laughs> I want ramen. <laughs> <laughs> when it comes to food, Hina is terrifying. If only she got to meet, she would get Hooray! to meet. If only she could meet the ultimate chef. I know, it's probably an ultimate chef. That's someone we should have in our fan game we're going to make. <laughs> that we're totally going to make. Yep. Extraordinary focus. That if uh, That's a damn good skill, if I remember. Okay. And we got some new skill points. That's why we picked her over Yasuhiro. Mm. So we can go to Yasuhiro now. Oh wait, no, he was annoying. Unless we want unless we want to fill out Hina's report card. All we're gonna get is more skill points though. Yeah we can do. He feels dizzy. I need sleep. Nighttime wasn't for a while, but I felt like my body had reached its limit. As I dropped on my bed of a bottomless pit. Hmm. In Japan, isn't it a vi isn't it a visual metaphor for you to breathe for you for you to see your breath and when you're horny? Yes. But also, he's got the dreaded cock hard disease. I was restless. Also, when you're hot and bothered. Nerg. At some point, I found myself wandering through a strange dream. I was trapped in a school with a fat guy. Blah, 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 blah. I've come from beyond the grave. <laughs> I'm gonna guide you. You gotta stab him. <laughs> I, no! I, I came back up from hell. <laughs> Motif. <laughs> I met Shakira on my way down. She was going back up. <laughs> She's a fat bitch. I'm a fat bitch. Blah. She taught me the ways of killing. <laughs> I will see him now. <laughs> <coughs> and within the dream, a voice echoed across the walls of my mind. I under. I under understand. Understand. It's being. Sp it's, it's speaking. It's being okay. Speaking. That voice. It's so familiar. It's. I understand. It's his. Yeah. It's me. I understand. I should understand everything. But I don't. My goal isn't to get out of here. It's to stay here. <gasps> huh. So this must be part of why he lost his memory. Like that. Like I said, I believe there's been about a year of them with, uh, you know, and their, their memory wiped. Okay. Maybe the point is they have to stay. Mm. Why would they have to do that? I don't fucking know. 
Why don't you tell me? You know, I I didn't get this when I first when I first saw it when I played through it, but I get it now. It makes sense to me now. Am I on the right path? Um, stick with it if you want. What am I trying to say? Hope. This is all for hope, and that's why I have to stay. I have to stay here. My dream just now. What? So strange. Huh? What's up, bitch? I've come to deliver the message of the Lord. It's me, Shakisha. Ah, <laughs> uh, they've got the knife. I thought we kept it in our drawer. Yeah. Gwer. <laughs> Whoa. That was weird. Whoa! I'm dodging! <laughs> he has learned the power of the dodge roll! <laughs> oh no, he doesn't actually get out of his bed. Oh. I'm afraid. Is he dead? Let's find out. Stop panting. It was you! <laughs> I'm Kakisha. <laughs> Kyo Kisha. I've come to deliver the message of lavender hair. I've come to deliver the message of Satan. He says, You fucking gay. <laughs> <laughs> you gay, you wanna come live with us? Lo, you fag. <laughs> Push the ass, bitch. Okay, goodbye. Is that it? Yep. <laughs> he sent you all this way. Yep. <laughs> That's how gay you are. <laughs> 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 I mean, did you see that how Sayaka was coming on to you? You ain't getting no puss. You ain't getting no puss, no hair. That's how gay you are. <laughs> Fucking answer me, bitch. I kill you. I'm out of here. I gotta go tell more people they're gay. Where, 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 where? I gotta go visit John Lennon. <laughs> <laughs> Hold me. Oh, goodbye, Monokuma. Bing bong. No more for me, thanks. Not yet. No more for me, students. <laughs> Good morning. Yeah. Motherfucker. What's up, bitches? It's your boy, Monokuma! What's happening, Drama Alert Nation? <laughs> Fucking hell. Let's get right to the news! <laughs> Somebody once told me this uh, bear yeah, was gonna roll his, me. His fever's gone now. Oh, good. That was easy. It's just a quick bug that he got. And then he quick had... bug. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> and then he had a. And then he's reminding himself of his dream. Oh. The dream. Uh, I dream the dream that lasts long. forever. <laughs> Couldn't quite get to sleep. Saw himself. And then. <gasps> it's his face. And then in the dream person Stab person was there holding a knife. He thought he thought didn't actually fight them off. <sighs> yeah, it went black again and then Kyokisha was there. Was, what a strange dream. Did Kyoko come in and fight them off? That's why we don't know. I bet she did. We don't know. She came in and went Ooh, and they were yeah. like I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> That's Kyokisha. Oh, you gay? I've Shit. learned the power of karate. <laughs> Swear I'll kick you with my toe. <laughs> right. Let's check for the knife. Oh yeah. The knife is obvious. Well, it wasn't a dream then. That confirms it. Smart. 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 I'm fucking smart. 
I'm gonna read this. What? Nothing inside? That's strange! He's turning into Monokuma. <laughs> because it definitely wasn't before. I'm positive I put the knife I got from Toko in here. Wait, that means... It wasn't a dream. The knife that I'm gonna keep safe is now in the hands of a crazy person. Teamwork! We did it! We killed us all. <laughs> Why would someone have wanted to attack me? Who was behind the mask? Why was Kyoko... What the fuck is going on? I don't think I'm gonna figure it out my own. My head hurts. Dining hall. Everyone. Hopes and They're dreams. all dead. Hopes and dreams. They're all dead. They're just all dead. <laughs> the second massacre uh, classroom. Byakuya has eaten them all. <laughs> nice joke. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, oh, Makoto! Yep, that's Makoto! It sure is the sky's blue! Um... Hey, Nina! Um... You really had me worried, you know? What happened to you last night? Worried? I mean... Yeah, right after naf night time here, we all went to get you. We were hammering away at your dobro, but you never answered. We thought maybe you'd been... You know... <laughs> I mean, not that that actually that actually happened. I mean, nobody here would want to, you know. So anyway, what are you doing? I didn't feel so good, so I went right to bed. I had no idea you got. Yeah, I had no idea you guys even showed up. But why did you come to get me? Did something happen? Hmm. Um. Well, lots of stuff actually. I'm not sure I can really explain. Okay. Let's go meet up with everyone else, and then we can tell you about it. I have to react. Just do it every time. So is everyone else waiting somewhere? Or... That's where? right. Oh yeah, we stayed up the whole night. The whole night? <laughs> <laughs> I lost a rock, paper, scissors, so I had to come get breakfast for everyone. Okay. So uh, you got here just in time. Come on, help me carry it. Okay, sure. <laughs> Everyone's in the gym. Hurry up, I'll meet you there. I love her giggles. This is unnerving me. This yeah. is how you do a fucking horror game. <laughs> Just make everyone act weird. That would freak me out. We must go to the gym. The gym. Ah, ah there he is. What was that? That. Is it dead Monokuma? Might be. Dead Monokuma? Might be. Huh? Oh, hey, Makoto. This is worse than being late for your wedding, the birth of your son, and your own funeral all at once. What? Jeez, to show up now like it's no big deal. <laughs> you made us stay up all night while you slept like a baby in your bed? Just like Hina said, everyone was there besides Kyoko. And then I noticed they formed a circle around something. As soon as I saw what that something was... What the?! Before I could catch myself, I cried out. Look at those tits. Yeah. That They really defined those tits in this CG. Mm. They don't do it anywhere else. They just went they all out. Have, they could have made them bigger. Ah. Spread out in front of them were the remains of Monokuma. What are you doing? What does it look like? We're dismantling it to see what makes it tick. <laughs> dismantling? But I mean, that's Monokuma you're messing with, right? Yeah, that's right. She's not even faced. Hmm. Relax, there's no danger. You say that, but... What is this? What are you guys doing? It looks like it's been professionally dismantled, uh, disassembled. How is that possible? Tearing apart something like that isn't dangerous? Seriously, what are you thinking? How can you say tearing apart something like that isn't dangerous? Hey, come on. Well, I guess I'll handle this. I'll explain what's going on, Makoto, because that's, that's how much I like you. Hmm. 
The Akuya found this little fella lying around, then we tore it apart. That doesn't explain anything! What? Was something broke. Just before we went to bed last night, I came to the gym to try and talk to Monokuma. I wanted to see if he had any new information about Kyoko's disappearance. And I found him here, just like normal, however. <laughs> when I found him, he was no more than a regular toy. He didn't react, didn't say a word. You're saying he wasn't moving at all? Hmm. I waited there until nighttime officially began, but still Monokuma laid there motionless. I gathered everyone up as quickly as possible so they could take a look. Even then, he still didn't make a move. So I immediately in initiated the disman disassembly process. <laughs> it was a master's stroke of genius, a chance to find out w what made Monokuma tick. Hmm. One thing we discovered is, is that he's quite a sophisticated machine. It leagues beyond any normal remote control toy. Who has enough free time to invest in something like that anyway? You. <laughs> but besides that, what I'm wondering is, why did he stop moving all of a sudden? The mastermind is distracted. I thought maybe he'd malfunctioned, but we didn't find any co causes. <sighs> but we didn't find any because we were m taking him apart. So if he didn't break... So if he didn't break down, so in other words, then maybe something happened to his puppeteer, the mastermind. Something unexpected. I can't imagine any other possibility. Something unexpected? <laughs> they were probably so scared of Master they ran away in terror. Highly doubtful. Or maybe <clears throat> they got sick or something? But Monokuma made his announcement this morning, right? Who was that if not the mastermind? Oh, I'm sure that's a recording. It's set to a timer and plays as necessary. Mm. That's true. He says the exact same thing every day, right? Hey. Oh. Hey, guys. I don't think now's a good time for light conversation. You know? I just found something. What is it? Looks like a bomb. <laughs> it, it, it's what? Hm. A bomb. There's one installed in every Monokuma robot, I'm sure. What? What? A bomb? That's super bad. We need to get rid of it. Uh, um... Roger that. Hmm. It appears the bomb has a motion sensor. Any sudden movements, it's sure to go off. What? What? Motion sensor? For serious? Uh, I'm starting to get all shaky. Just a second. Hey, get it together. You're a man, aren't you? Yeah. I, I'm fine. I'm, I'm totally fine. <sighs> oh. Get a hockey you're, stick you're and throw so... it away. <laughs> You're so not fun. You're all ah, ah, ah. Oh, I probably should have mo yeah. Oh, I probably should have mentioned the motion sensor is off right now. <laughs> Jeez, don't scare me Boom, like that. Boom, dead. God, you're like the world's most spineless worm of the century. That is an explosive device, Owie. <laughs> don't be mean. Hey, come on, the century's just getting started. Don't call me the race. Don't call the race already. <laughs> Whatever, just hurry up and put the bomb down. Hang on to it so it not do anyone any good. Uh, um, oh yeah, good call. Could blow up the wall. Well? Okay, it's down. Everything's all good. Hero put the bomb down, but that way that wasn't my main concern at this point. My eyes were glued to Monokuma's remains. He just stopped moving all of a sudden. Was it really because something had happened to the Mastermind that they weren't expecting? But what could that have been? When I thought about it... <clears throat> blah blah, this shit again. Just a second. Hey, uh, Makoto? Huh? Hey. Don't hurt Didn't you hear a thing we just said? Huh? Huh? <laughs> so that's a no. What are you, some kind of brain-dead farm animal? Moo? <laughs> <laughs> Boink. We were saying, since we're done dismantling Monokuma, what should we do now? How about I tell you the fascinating story of my dream? And we've decided to continue our offensive assault. It's all clear now. To try and uncover the Mastermind's true identity, we're going to break into the Headmaster's room. Really? Naturally. Since the Mastermind appears to have stopped all activity, now's our chance, wouldn't you agree? 
but if the mastermind comes back while we're in there? What? If you're scared, you're welcome to stay here by yourself. <laughs> or I'll go, live, I'll go live in the chicken coop with all the other chickens. You could be chicken number th six. Because there are usually five chickens! Such ignorance. <laughs> How many people are left? Six. There is Biakuya, Kyoko, Yasuhiro, Aoi, Toko, Makoto, Makabuba, Ishibuba, Mukro Ikusaba. Okay. But yeah, I mean, I, I don't want to have to kill each other or any or anyone else, but we we have a chance now. Come on. So, what are you going to do? Are you going to run away, or are you going to fight? Bye! <laughs> You're right, I'll go with you. It's all clear now. Okay then, we're going to break into the headmaster's room. Everything comes down to this moment. Anything can happen, so prepare yourselves. <laughs> I'll follow you anywhere, master, to all the ends of the earth. <laughs> you ragtag band of flankies. <laughs> Sakura, if you can hear me, lend me your strength. <laughs> she just fucking gets really buff, <laughs> smashes the floor. I can do this. Breaks Makoto in half. <laughs> too much! I Sakura, tone it down! It's only a little bit on blue fire. She says, Mortals cannot handle this! I am Sakukisa. <laughs> I have come from beyond, and I hated what I saw. Man, you're getting too dangerous. I'm gonna have to take you out. <laughs> the epic battle between Shakisha and Shakukisha. Ow, owie sak, owie Ow. kura. <laughs> I can do this. I'm a man. I can do this. Ura. I've got the will of the entire universe on my side. Casual like the water. <laughs> And a coward within. within. Lazy as sundown. Because when the sun goes down, it's going to sleep, so it's lazy. Lazy as your lyrics. There's no fire within. within. <laughs> You're a pathetic, spineless fucking cunt. And you haven't got a clue. Wait till Monokuma's through with you. <laughs> We each found determination on our <laughs> Tiger was the headmaster's room. How many are gonna die? What is in the headmaster's room? Find out in the next episode. Whoa! Uh, well, that, look, well, that's that. Thank you all for watching. Like, favorite, and subscribe. And until next time, bye! I say not by, I say why? <laughs>